Here in Storm's Eye, Devin obtained the item's lift key. Damn, and I ran right into the wall. I don't think I did that. Y'all y'all already know who I am, bro. I did not hit myself in the wall like up uh, two walls, bitch. Wait, hold on. It looks like it looks like it's I'm doing like Twitch plays. Hold on. Then I depart. Wait, well, okay, so I don't really know what I did from inside there. It's not gonna really explain what happened there because I know this didn't happen right here. So you know what? Let's skip this. Wait, what? I interrupted a dude's like slot machine. This man would have killed me. But then I started playing right next to him, and then he won like jackpot right then and there. But then I took his jackpot and then left and then tried to go in back inside. Wait, yeah, no, this is definitely AI shit, my nigga. Huh? Wait, what? So I went back inside that bitch and then I started what? Then I took over the fucking place and then stole that man's self scope. Nah, this is too much random. Wait, no, I really did take that bitch over. Hold on. There's too much randomness. Wait, what happened after this? Oh, wait, no, I ended up back in the same spot, bro. Fucking hell, man. I'm about to cope because you know what? I am back, ladies and gentlemen, for a new episode of Pokemon Cope. I'm sorry I had to deal with that BS that, that was in like the intro and shit because I have no idea why like the whole AI does like prolongs the freaking like me walking into like, look, if I... If I was doing shit like this in an episode, bro, nobody would be watching my shit, bro. Nobody would be watching me doing shit like this, like a fucking bot the entire time, bro. Like I'm playing, like we playing Twitch plays fucking like Pokemon Cope. Nigga, no, 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 no. So anyways, we are back in this bitch and we got to go into Lavender Town. In Lavender Town, I don't... Buddy, um, actually, you won't be escaping this place. Wait, hold on. I beat your boss, and your boss came up out of here and said, don't let this little nigga leave. Okay, so this is how they play here. Then they play dirtier than the Rockets. But they are storm chasers, though. This is a Jewish storm chaser. He gonna send out a knitting. Nigga, you gotta be knitting me, bro, because I'm fucking low health and I'm paralyzed. This bitch about to kill me. Wait, but I'm level 52, though, nigga, so it doesn't even fucking... Never mind, I get immediately paralyzed right then and there wink hulu wink hulu hold on he's sending out the whole app what the fuck wink hulu look like like that one shit off of pokemon desolation yeah i'm definitely escaping little nigga hold on wait I, I don't know if i fought this bitch yet or not but let me just switch to florida real quick just to be safe okay yeah i did fight him but still boom let me go out here bitch real quick before the ai says i bump into anybody and then fucking team rocket catches up to me i'll be right back all right well onwards with the adventure as i was adventuring in celadon just trying to see what was different i did manage to grab a new pokemon at the very top i don't know if i should show y'all or anything like that or if anybody hasn't played fire red but for those of y'all who played fire red if y'all go into that one apartment building but y'all go into the back of the apartment building there's gonna be like a secret in you know what let me just show y'all real quick as soon as you enter celadon city for all those newcomers out there that don't know about this secret glitch right here it's not really a glitch or anything like that but it's a little secret pathway you go behind this shit you go up here and then you go right in the back of this apartment building go inside and then if you follow those steps all the way to the very fucking highest part of the stairs or the apartment building you won't find this old man, but you'll definitely find yourself a Pokemon, which is called Algegrab. An Algegrab, I call that bit Algebra. It's a goddamn, like, Mario, Squirtle, Turtle looking shit. And it looked cool. It's a Dragon type, man. Y'all gonna love this shit. I don't know. It's level 25. We gonna see what he got, what he got in the bag. Then, if you keep going further left, you got this, like, random old nigga. What? You egg? He stabs you. And Devin puts the, wait, what? He stabbed me and then gave me a lucky... He stabbed me with a fucking lucky egg, bitch. And the lucky egg didn't break on top of that, too. What the hell? Anyways. On to... On to the adventure. So, I ended up managing to freaking grab tea. It looks awfully tasty. Huh? And we ended up giving this little nigga tea. Wait, wait. We gave this nigga tea. Hold up. We gave this nigga tea for real. Bitch... And I'm already in Saffron City, so is Saffron the next move, or was it Fuji Fuji City? I'm not not really all too sure. But anyways, we need to go back over here, not Route Eight, but we need to go back into freaking Lavender Town. 
I guess not. In order to get that freaking ghost thing, find Mr. Fuji or some shit. Hold on one second. You will pay. Well, we made it to the top of Lavender Town, and this bit's talking about we will pay. Your life shall be taken from you. From who? By who, man? Let's see who you finally are, bro. Reveal yourself, little nigga. What the hell are you? Bitch, you a spirito? You gotta be shitting me, bro. It's the fucking spirit of a weedle or um, waddle, wadido, that, that green fucking like, that green type bitch, bro. Not green. What am I talking? That water type weedle? Crunch this nigga, bro. Get him out of here, man. Goodbye, bro. Move out of here, man. You did all that for what, bro? I didn't even want to hear your cry. Thank you, bro. Thank you. The ghost was the shadow of the oblivion. Spirito was skinned dead. How you skin a fucking like ghost bug type completely dead again, nigga? That shit's creepy. If a bug could come back to life and you was able to kill that bitch again, bro, I would never be able to do that shit. No, Spirito lost. It's all over. If it's all over now, then why the hell you want to fight me, bitch? I'm the one who beat Spirito. And you want to fight me? Come on, bro. Let's see what you got going on, man. I'm not even going to skip this shit. He going to send out a Wawa Wee Wee. Yeah, this is the spirit of Wawa Wee Wee. How I said Wawa Wee Wee good at first and then I fuck it up right after when I made the joke, man. Come on. This shit really made me want to look bad. Damn, that bitch really is a water type. Thank you for the fucking one shot. You gonna send out a Weedle? I should send out Algebra on your ass. Algebra, you are ugly as hell from the back, my nigga. I'm not gonna lie to you, bro. You look funny as shit. Son look funny as hell, bro. What kind of goddamn... <laughs> what kind of shit is this, man? That bitch look like a goddamn rhinoceros mixed with a fucking chameleon, bro. And a Charizard... Mixed with a Squirtle on top of that, too. Spweedle? The fuck is a Spweedle? Hmm. Spweedle? This is a cool-ass Weedle. I see why he's called Spweedle. He got spec choices on, right? You know, the SPA. I was going to say SPA. That's how you know I got to stop playing this game. The SPE from spec choices. And then they mixed it up with Weedle. Spweedle. I see what they did there, bro. Fuck out of here, man. Overheat. How the fuck, but I'm a dragon type. Crit hit, thank God for that. How the fuck that bitch almost killed me? I'm a dragon type bit, am I not? Am I tripping? Hold up. It's over. Get out your feelings, nigga. You almost killed me. I should be saying it's over. Get the fuck out of here. Talking about it's so over. Depressed ass nigga. He probably got possessed by one of them Spweedles. Yo, what's up, B? How you doing? This old guy marched right up into our hideout. Then he starts ranting about how Team Storm's abusing Pokemon. So we're just talking it over as adults. You sure? So why is he still here? He should be back in his home. Carousing to the goddamn dead mons. If he still, if he like, you know, still cares about them or some shit. You're not getting away with this. But wait, Fuji's not the bad guy though. What the fuck? Yo, Fuji, you alright? Huh? You came to save me? Thank you. But I came here on my own free will, little nigga. I came to calm the spirit of a lonely child. I can feel Weedle's spirit has moved on from this world. This tower will no longer be tormented any longer. It's kind of embarrassing that this shit was being tormented by a goddamn Weedle called Spweedle of all fucking minds, bro. Come on. Spirit. It wasn't called Spweedle, my bad. It was called Spiritle. But still, bro. Come on. Of all minds. Follow me to my home, the Pokemon house, at the foot of this tower. Okay. Hey, good looks out, nigga. Good looking out is what I meant, dickhead. What? Oh, shit. This was your house. I knew that, nigga. Devin. Wait, no. It's supposed to be a little bit more dramatic. Devin. Your Pokedex is... Oh, wait. I mean... Your Pokedex quest is one that requires strong dedication, little nigga. However, without deep love for your Pokemon, your quest may fail. I'm not sure if this will help you, but I'd like you to have it, little nigga. Ah, hey, okay, cool. Thank you, bro. Upon hearing, yeah, 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 shut up, nigga. I know how to fuck to use a Poke Flute. 
talking about upon hearing a goddamn flute, man. I know that Snorlax is going to wake up, nigga. I'm going to catch that motherfucker. Hold up. Now, before I even think about doing that, can I put one of these whole ass... Can I put... Wait, no. Can I put one of these whole ass niggas to sleep? No, I don't want to do that. But do one of these niggas know any sleep moves? Whew. Okay, so let's see what we got going on. I decided to take oomph with me. Welcome back to the team oomph, baby girl. I ain't seen you since freaking like, what's that one place called? Viridian City, bitch. Welcome back to the team because your ass no yawn, right? We got to put this bitch to sleep. If it's still a Snorlax though. I mean, if, well, no, if it's like a regular Snorlax, I'm not going to catch that nigga, bro. What I look like, look at this shit, man. Full team fakie mon, and I'm going to throw a regular ass Snor Snorlax. I was going to call that bitch Snorlax inside there. Come on, bro. What I look like, man. Y'all know me, man. I'm too smart for this shit. Man, stop moving. All right, so let's see what they got going on. Yo, oh, wait, I already fought this little nigga. I didn't even realize that. What's up, B? Be patient. Fishing is a waiting game, so that's why you're looking like behind the water because you don't want to see. You don't want the fish to see that you're looking at them. So that way, if you had turned your back on them, they'll think, "Oh, I'm not worried. This nigga's not worried about me." And then, boom, sight, got you, bitch. You got, you get one right there. Okay, chip. I see you with that fisherman strat, but you not, re you really not gonna catch nobody using C, man, bitch. Come on, bro. Scuba anti, you're not gonna beat nobody or catch any fish with these mons, nigga. The fuck is wrong with him, bro? Hank, you ain't shit either, bro. Yo, what's good? You alright? I made that kid down there cry when I cheated in an online tournament. Honestly, it was pretty fun. Can I whoop your ass for cheating in an online tournament? What kid? Oh, you made this little nigga cry? How could Darky go zero and two of man? Come on. It's just not fair. Darky. I'm glad that bitch fucking like lost. Why he called his mom Darky? Yo, what's going on over here? Eat aters? Oh shit. Hey Jess. If we win, I'll marry you. Who the fuck? Hmm, damn. So Shorty gonna propose to, like, buddy? He can find love, but I... Oh, come on, bro. Really? Get the fuck out of here with that easy ass battle. Hold on. Use the pokey flu. Wake this bitch up. Ah. Hey. Oh, Moyalif. It attacked with a grumpy rage. I bet he remind me of like something off of like goddamn Stardew Valley. This ugly ass mom, man. Goddamn Steve Harvey. I, it, I feel like he about to pull a goddamn like joke on me every two seconds. Oh, Steve Harvey looking as old Mr. Fucking Potato Head ass goddamn mom. Pro will pass Potato Head ass mom. Put this bitch to sleep. There we go. <laughs> Oh, bitch, that shit put me to fucking sleep in real life, bro. Hold up. Now, just spam this bitch with fucking Ultra Balls. Let me see. Easy. Moyalith is caught with full health. Thank God. The only thing is that that bitch is asleep. So, let's see what the man is all about. I should have called him Steve Harvey, man. Wait, did I cast this bitch before? Why did it not let me see the freaking, like, description, the Pokedex description of this little nigga? Yo, what's up, man? How you doing? Oh, were you looking for a super rod? Sorry, it's not here. The guy who hasn't moved into... The nigga who had to move into a fucking house somewhere in like Island 1, Sevy Island or some shit like that. What the fuck I look like going to a goddamn Sevy Island, bitch? Shit's so stupid. It's so fucking ridiculous, man. You mean to tell me I gotta go all the way to the Sevy Islands just to do some bullshit? Just to go find some... Oh, wait, hold on. Just to find some dumb shit. Yo, Camper Justin, please. Thank you, bro. You you, you fought me just to protect the freaking goddamn Sunstone, bro. He was never even going to use that shit. What's this? My onwards with the adventure. I call myself a good mon. But if anything, I'll show y'all. Damn. Damn, this shit look kind of clean. But I'm going to show y'all what that good mon look like. Damn. When I hit the freaking Fuji City. I don't know. Fuji Town. Fuji Village. One of them Fujis. What is this ugly ass mon right here? Hold up. Bit a little crazy. Bitch, if you don't get the fuck out of here, Paul Tier. Oof, wait, hold on. I forgot about this spot right here. Route 13, north to the Silence Bridge. Man, please, this is a silent. Baby, girl, hold on, wait. Ooh, you play with me, sweetie. Sweetie pop. 
You got a twin? Hold on. Both y'all fight. Oh, damn. Y'all fighting separate? Okay. I respect it. I respect it. All right. So, hmm, bro, I'm literally legit low on health, bro. Please don't look over here. I need to dodge all these niggas. I need to dodge all these niggas right now. I need to dodge all. Man, please don't look up. I can fight this one nigga. No, I can't. I, I, I'm good. I'm chilling. Fuck cool ass looking mon. I'm not gonna lie, but I'm not worried about no cool looking mons right now, bro. I knew his ass would want to fight. And he gonna have the four fucking mons right there. Really? Really? This is what we're really doing? And that bitch had, oh my goodness. Okay, you ho, boxer Billy. You about to meet Mr. Um, damn, well, I was about to say my name was Jake Paul, bro. We do not want to make that mistake again. But let's do Earth Power on you twice. No K-pop. Hit that bitch with the triple super effective. Nope, it was just a regular effect. Burn Nugget. You gonna send Burn Nugget out? Burn Nugget is a fire type. If I bird nugget looking like goddamn like fucking like Rigby or some shit. He look like Mordecai off of like regular show, bitch. A fire version of that nigga. Glue course. Damn, that boy look cool. What the hell? That boy made out of glucose, nigga. Glucose, glucose, glucose. Let's try steel types. Damn, that's really effective on glucose, if anything. Shit. You would never expect like point like metal to poison fairy types, bro, or to poison glucose of all things, if anything. Holy Christ, level seventy, and I only got twenty, um, like a thousand twenty HP. Really? Yeah, you can do that all you fucking want, little nigga. Goodbye, Devin. Go eat a fucking dick, bro. Thank fuck, dude. I was calling it Fuji City this entire time, but that bitch was called Fuchsia City. You know what? I can't, bro. I can't cope with tonight's episode of Pokemon Cope. If anything, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. We got to see a lot of great looking like fake Emon. And you know what? I'll probably pop like, you know, a couple of like great looking fake Emon. I'm sorry if this episode sounds like like sounds or smells or feels like ass. Um, it's just like train of thought is like all over the place, if anything. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Nonetheless, if you did leave a like down below and let me know what Um, let me know if you want to see some more pokemon coat because look at this goddamn slave i mean i mean zoo that they got over here they got a fucking like damn baby girl hold up what's this oh shit it's a fucking troll okay cool anyways with that being said i'm gonna catch y'all in that next episode if y'all love today's episode leave a like down below if you want to see a new episode and before we even end hold on let me show y'all some cool fakey mons i don't know if they got like fakey mon over here that bitch look like that from the outside. I've seen that bitch before. And what's this? Oh, shit, look. Dynamite. Hey, it's an extremely rare Pokemon that's re been regenerated from a fossil. And they got that bitch chilling right there. He look like he ready to, like, break out that shit anytime he feel like it. Damn. All right, all right, all right. And what else they got right here? Hold up. And they got this regular basic ugly ass fucker. Of a duck over here. Okay, cool. It's a fighting duck. I see why they call that bitch a fucker. I I mean. Then we got this shit right here. Petch it. All right, you know what? I can't petch with this bullshit anymore. I don't know if that meant anything. But hey, with that being said, hope y'all enjoyed. Catch y'all. Subscribe for some more Pokemon action. Damn, voice crack right there. Peace.